Welcome back to Bilar. We have the Holga action figure from Dungeons and Dragons Honor Among Thieves movie. I never saw this movie, but I hear it wasn't too bad. I mean, it can't be worse than that first TND movie. It was really, really bad, the live action one. Uh, this is a Hasbro figure. Came out in 2023. Made in Vietnam. Uh, looks like she has a couple accessories. Axe and a knife. So I really picked this up more as a Michelle Rodriguez action figure. Plus it was on sale for $4.99 at Ross, marked down from $13. So I do like the box art. I think it looks pretty cool. Can definitely tell who it is. Alright, let's open it up. See how it actually looks. Some tape here. Worst fox, I guess. <laughs> well, it's nicely wrapped. This like cardboard thing here. It's interesting. Um, That's, I'm sure it's fine, but it feels really cheap. <laughs> kind of doing it this way, and these like, just recycled little bags. Anyways, let's see. And it's sealed, it looks like. All right. There we go. Okay, this looks pretty good. First impressions as far as it looks. Because I haven't seen the movie, but I'm guessing these tattoos are, are spot on, I would hope. Face looks good. You can tell what's Michelle, Rod Michelle Rodriguez, Imrod. Uh, I'm not sure about this gear. I guess that's what she wore. She's some kind of like barbarian fighter, I'm guessing. Named Holga. Hmm. She has a spear. And an axe. Okay, this axe is two part. Oh, here's the knife. This is the knife. Detach. Hmm. I don't know. Looks like this whole piece could probably come off. Uh, as far as articulation, these elbow joints, arms are pretty small. Uh, these legs are pretty stiff. It looks like there's a knee joint there. I don't... Man, okay, that's just really, really tight. Pops back in. If you can hear it. Alright. So this goes from like a two-handed axe to a one-handed axe, I'm guessing. Oh, so you have a choice of keeping it one-handed, it looks like, or you can take this off, this brown piece here, put it onto the here, whoops. Okay, so real quick, I tried to look up how to put this axe on to here, and you have to take the axe head off, I guess. You can see there's a little bit of a seam there. 
that's so on there that like when I pull it, it feels like it's going to break. And I don't want to break it just to put the longer axe head on here. So, yeah, there's a, there's a lot of minuses to this action figure. I mean, that's really pretty lame. I mean, it's, it's on there really good. So and I don't want to break it because I'm going to have at least this axe. All right, just a quick heads up on how the axe is supposed to go on here. Um, I don't guess she even hold her axe. It's always important, right? We have it in this hand. I don't know, these are very, eh. I always feel like I'm gonna break the thumb off when I do this. Hmm. Looks like it snaps in. No, right. I was trying to force it the wrong way. It just kind of slides in from the side. And she can't hold it, which is fine. Uh, looks like this arm's getting a little loose already. Let's see, shoulder, can you go up any? Can you raise your axe above your head? No. <laughs> uh, All right, I'm sure this is just a collector's item where you just pose it. Uh, can you really stand well? Uh, got the ankle movement. I don't know, this action figure might suck. <laughs> might it be kind of bad. Oh my goodness. Yeah, there's a... A benefit to cheap action figures that are like less articulate as far as like ankle rockers and all that junk you don't have to do this so gets on my nerves stand up okay I think I just got lucky yeah and stand up <laughs> feels bulky like Certainly feel like the picture to me. Don't know why. I'd have to see the movie maybe. See if this looks better than I think. I don't. Not a huge fan, but for four ninety nine, it's fine. And the face sculpt I like. The hair looks okay. Good. Um, it might be look better without this gear. I don't know. Cause this looks really bulky standing's kind of a pain well it's all right x goes in the back so that was kind of cool these arms could be bigger so the proportions seem off but they're probably not off i think it's this big bulky thing here let's make it look a little more messy than it is but it looks like it's constructed okay let's say it's constructed okay but thanks for watching triple r have a good day or night wherever you are